It's your boy, that boy, Bari. This is Jay Willard, the podcast killer, a.k.a. Podcast Poppy, a.k.a. the pop father, man. This is Willard Wednesdays. You about to get some ghetto news from your relationship gurus. Bow. Hold on. Whoa, that was a nice Whoa. gun. Wait. Wait, I feel like I shot somebody. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that, was a really, that was a really nice gun. Wait, I really... see you, brother. Shout out to Wade on the check-in, man. Real quick, wait. Can you can you hit the gun sound one more time? My bad. Nah, that's tight. That's a solid. That's a solid gun sound. <laughs> solid I think Wade, gun. Wade recorded that in his backyard. <laughs> you think Wade out there shooting people? Yeah, yeah. Wade out there letting it go. Oh, it's just the Bronx. This gun shots in Bronx. Uh, yeah, that Bronx. You got your phone outside. That's that Bronx shit. But their guns weren't that good, so. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like a, a legit 45, though. I just want to point out. Like, that's a, not that I know what a gun sound sound like, but I'm just saying. You know what a 4-5 sound like. Heard I, mean, I'm, I mean, I'm something okay. I know. But. No, I'm right. Chicago. <laughs> that's, that's that Chirac. Heard it. Okay, Chirac. I hate that shit. No, Chicago. Shot Town. Relax. All right. Shout, shout so Chirac. Chirac. So what's good, fellas? Shout Chirac. Shout out to Chicago. 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 Bro, you tell me what's the word, man. How we feeling? What's going on? How was y'all week and shit? Chilling, chilling, chilling. Chilling. You like always chilling, chilling, chilling. I got yeah. a question for y'all. Oh, we gonna start off? Okay, let's do I, it. I can't even know what your how your week was. I said I was so, chilling. I just so said I was chilling. Dame? So what about Dame's week? We didn't ask Dame. I, I mean, Dame probably don't care about his week. He don't because he. Be I don't care about week. my week. That's yeah. crazy. His wow, whole week. Bro. Fuck his week, right? Damn. He fucked up. He like Donda. Damn. <laughs> wow. If that means that I'm the number one album in the world? What the fuck? Yes, of course, nigga. I said you don't <laughs> like it. I didn't say nothing about being the number nah, one album. You, say, you really? said I'm fucked up like Donda. You know what no, I said because you like Donda. I didn't say you like Donda. Is it me or is this not computing? The computers is puting. <laughs> the computers is puting. <laughs> I said you like Donda. I didn't say you're like, like Donda. I yo, you like the yo fuck you right now, bro. I can't do this. What are you talking about, Dame? How was your week, brother? This is stressing me out. <laughs> he just stressed me out. <laughs> he like, a computer's pute, but when they're not puting, that mean that you're not a computer. <laughs> Yo, well, how was your week, sir? Oh, man, week was good, man. Um, just know there's some real opportunities happening on the music side, and I'm happy, man. I'm, I'm, I'm excited to be a part of it, so it's dope, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's dope, man. I'm happy. So some music shit is going down. All right. Yeah, man. And I'm uh, we in Atlanta now, so we are here planning the next steps. Next steps. So how the, how we can do the takeover, baby? That's that. That's it. That's that. I respect it. So nothing from Bari. So I guess we can start the show. Fuck y'all, man. My week was great. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh. oh wow. yeah, you, you too. Well, <laughs> Fire. Okay, I had a great week. What's going um, on? I was in New York for a little bit, flew but back home. Went to the crib. Yeah. How, it was, how was that? Bro, it's always a vibe when you touch when you touch the city for real. Like yeah. as I get older, I realize I can't live there. Uh, Fuck New York. But I love New York. Mm, okay. So, I've said yeah. that since I've lived there. I, yeah. I I hate living in New York. I love visiting though. But the vibe of New York is is always gonna be the vibe of New York. But fuck okay. living there. All that shit for no reason. I, 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 but listen, yeah, yeah. Shout, shout out to all my peoples back home. It was it was great seeing y'all. But we back in the A. We back with the takeover. Mm-hmm. As, soon as, as soon as as soon as I touched down, we got back to work. It was like you feel me? Like, like, that's how it was. We got right back to the right back to the bag. Right back to the money. So and we here. It's with the Wednesdays, man. That's that's how my week was. Let's get it, man. Bar, you said you had you had something to ask. What's going on? He said he had a question. Uh, Since his week was a bum ass week. 
Always. Yeah, my, my week was regular, regular. How Is many songs? How many <laughs> songs does a person have before you take them off the aux cord? It's actually a really good question. How many songs does a person have before you take them off the aux cord? Mm-hmm. Can I? Ask you? We in a car. God damn, COVID. All right, all right. We in a car, car bumping. Okay, we car, Delta. <laughs> we in the car bumping, vibing. You feel me? Yeah. Moving. We out for the night. You get two with me. It's two. You get two. I'm you get two. I'm short with the ox. It's two. You get. You get. You get the benefit of the doubt. No, you. No, you get a mistake, and then you get a benefit, benefit of the doubt. doubt. Yeah, yeah. So and then that after that, you get the fucking you get him up out of here or her. You get two with me. So what if it's like okay? What if you get like a, a in between, like a eh? Like we say, the first one is a flop, but the second I, one is like a. So okay, so my, my whole life I've lived. Ty goes to the runner. Wait, what? Yeah, Ty goes to the runner. In the sports, when you play baseball, Ty, if if you meet the bag the same time the ball does, the runner gets the benefit of the doubt. If if the record isn't, my bad, I don't know that. I'm sorry, because you okay. Not that I don't know sports. But I don't know baseball references. You you cool. you, hit, you hit me with some old school shit. So a tie, so the tie means okay. That's someone throws throw the, ball. the ball. Got you. you. Him, but the niggas step on the bag at the same time. Got you. More okay. times than not, the tie will go to the runner. We give really? it to him. Yeah, I didn't you know that. You safe on the bag. You made it cool. I'm the same way with music, right? Okay. If, wow. if a record play and it's not a it's not a knock it out the park home run, but it ain't some boo boo. And we kind of rocking, but we not. I will give you that. I give you one of those. That's what if the you get two. But well, what if you I get two I'm, of those back to back though? You're off. You're off. I yeah, think I, I'm, I'm just. I'm, I'm really just bugging the baseball. Reference. But thank you for teaching. Like you learn some. You know how you say you learn some shit every day. Damn, oh. stuck on the wrong thing. <laughs> they would be like the baseball <laughs> reference. No, nigga, no, pick no, the fucking I'm, question. Like, I'm answer wake the question. up tomorrow and be like, does the tie go to the runner? What's that mean? Nigga, but okay, answer the that, question. That, 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 right, to, but yeah, me personally, you get one of those. Yeah. And you get a what the hell and get him the fuck out of here. Pack so him up. What about slap? What if it's a slap trash and then a and wait, then a I, in? I was going to say that. I was going to say oh, so. Wait, so wait, that's not two in a row. You got one that was banger and the one that was a mess up. So you so, get another so, shot. So basically, you could rock on the ox as long as it's popping. And then you get one that we like, eh. So I'll give you one more. And then you go, ah, again, it's like you out. Yes. So it's, like two, it's like two strikes you out. The best baseball what reference. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> I, I said that from the jump. But what it, what it, okay, I'm, I'm sounding stupid. You get two but, with me. That's it. So cool. Yeah. What if it's a banger and... Banger, yeah. Are you good? So with uh, with that, no, you're okay. it changes the game. It changes no, the game, though. It, it changes. No, that's good. It, it changes, and bar you're not gonna like this. But going back to the Donda conversation, it changes because of song placement. Oh, come on now, stop talking that shit. I'm just saying. So fast yeah. forward. If fast forward, let's get oh, off of it. We can't do it no more. No more Donda. If, if you give I'm me a slap, this. if you give me a slap, and then eh. And then a slap, and then eh, your next one better be a slap. Because if it's eh or under, get pack them right. up. Pack them up. So pretty what if much it's like, you, you, what if it's like, okay. It's like, okay. If it's a, if it's okay, that's not good enough. Because you, you played me a slap. Remember? Are, yeah. We, okay. we led with a, a banger. A sure fire banger. Right. We, right. Okay. okay. You get two with me, because that's that. I think, I, them off. I, honestly think them that, I think that's a pretty good number as far as off the ox. I ain't gonna front. Really, no, no, no. I'm, I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. I mean, it's three minutes. Yeah. If I give you two bucks, that's six minutes. That's a terrible bump. But well, yeah. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. With me, it's it start. I'm talking about off the gate. Like, if you come off crazy, I'm talking about you come out the gate with a turnover. Oh, yeah, it's over again. <laughs> I'm talking about a bad turnover. You yeah, you hand that over. Hand that no, over. I, I can't. I can't say one and done. I can't say one and done. I can't I'm say talking one about one and done. Off the gate, right? You get it's fair. a call full yeah, of. It's, just it's not all fair. of us in the car, and then you come out the gate with a, a like a I'm a, a bad. But done. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Not, not everybody so, out strong, man. No, no, no. Because sometimes you have an idea, but you just the room just don't receive. 
Yeah. What she was given. You like, what? oh, I got yeah, it. Donda, you Donda, like, Donda, 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 Donda. You know, no, 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 no. That, that's a stretch. I'm saying you like, yo, I got this new WizKid song. Y'all got to hear this. And we like, okay. You hit play. I'm sorry. And don't, like, don't, 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 say like, somebody else. Don't disrespect the, the No, no, no. I'm the, not the disrespecting. You got to use somebody dis- else. No, no. But that's my you point. Use somebody so, else as an example. This is my point, though. Because as you know, we all fuck with WizKid, right? So yeah. imagine being like, oh, I got this new WizKid album. Oh, let me. Oh, y'all got to hear this new single. Oh, man. Yo. And then you hit play. And then everybody's like. What the fuck is this? I don't like this one. <laughs> yeah. I can't oh. take you off the for that. Yeah, I can't take you off the odds for that, bro. Cause, cause typically whiskey hits. It's like so now you got excuses. Like, oh shit. Well, typically this would hit. This not hitting with y'all. Oh wow. Okay. Well, let me let me yeah. let me clean you it up. Know let me clean it up. Let me clean it up. Because you, you thought I it was a hit. Game. No, you thought it was a hit. That's why. Yeah, sure. But sometimes the room. No, no, okay. oh, wait, but, so, but, so no I'm not talking play, about. What if no, playing I'm playing whiskey. What if you playing whiskey, but the whole room is DMX fans? No, no, no. What I'm saying. What I'm saying is. It's no. not going to hit. Fair enough, bro. No, no, no. I'm it's with that, right? It's not going to hit. Fair enough. Ooh, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm, no, not, I'm, I, not, I'm, I'm not. I'm not Caribbean or, and, that, and uh, we are African, but I'm I'm just now learning about Afrobeat in general. So if it was a room of me and my friends from Chicago, they like, what is this? They don't play that stuff in Chicago, yeah? That's real. It's so they'll be, like, the be like, what is this? And y'all like, it's nobody. Right, but but they like, I guess, you know what I'm saying. So what, what, I'm, what I'm saying, what I'm but saying. But they look at you and you like, all right, you get one more chance, cause they're like, all right, give me something else. And then you went, yeah. my name is Ho, Oh, H to the O B. It's like, okay, yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't say one is dumb. That's tough. That's tough. To, that's <laughs> tough to keep somebody done, off the hook. I'm talking about one. Like, that's tough. I can't, I can't do that for uh, one. Uh, some people give you a second chance. But my, this is my thing, right? And this is why I say to people all the time, the power of the ox is not for everybody. Don't touch it. You're but everybody that. has what they like. No, no, no. Just because you, you... But this is why I'm saying the ox cord is not for everybody. You understand? Yes, we all have our shit that we like. There's songs that, like I said, we I like that you, I know that y'all just don't rock with. And that's fine. Mm-hmm. But the ox cord... It's not meant for everybody. Don't because touch you it. Because you are the curator of the vibe for that for time. For everybody, not just yourself yeah. now. It's not about, oh, I like this shit. No, 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 no. Don't touch this shit right here. This, this shit right here. Different. But it's two different vibes. Because sometimes you want to vibe out by yourself out so loud. So then don't touch the you ox cord. You can't I, do I, that. I disagree, Dame. I disagree, Dame. Can I but do I, that? I, I, didn't go, I didn't go to the other part. Or I was no, going to no, say. Well, I'm, I'm just going to disagree. It was an A and B. It was an A and B. That A is bad. I'm gonna say A. I is never good, said my B. But you you don't need bad. it. A you stands need alone it. by itself. A is bad. A, A is terrible. terrible. A is do terrible. Not, do not do not get on the aux bumping shit for you and only you. No sir. No sir. To my there's yo, this is what I want to listen to tonight. And you in a room full of twenty people. There's, you sound crazy. Rules to the, uh, so you mean to tell me I could jump on the aux and play Russian rap? Because that's what I fuck with. No nigga. If the room if the room don't want to hear that, that's terrible. <laughs> No. Now, so, no. So, so as a person who has DJ, and no offense to Russian rap, I'm sorry. <laughs> you just offended no, all the no, Russians. No offense to Russian rap. You know what? We should do a Russian rap video reaction. Yo, Can we relax. Can we that relax? coming next. No, I'm actually on that. What the fuck is Russian rap? That's actually yeah, kind of we don't find somebody comment below what Russian rap is. Can somebody, no, 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 yo, somebody, co- who is a Russian rapper that we should follow? Yeah, I need, I'm pretty, I need some dope shit. Let's do a reaction to it. I'm pretty sure it's a Russian guy on trap beats killing it. Like, right now. We got a Russian Tory Lanez. He's out there. Yo, it's gotta be. Yeah, he's out there. Can mm-hmm. we please? <laughs> like, nah, you say that now, but that's how we would say the thing. Fire so shit. No, but if somebody would have told you that a Canadian rapper would be the best rapper in America, think about it, bro. You say get the fuck out of here. Twelve years ago, you'd have been like, "That shit is wild." Ain't no I Russian didn't... rapper finna out rap niggas from Brooklyn. I didn't. I'm say sorry, I said it wrong. But you know what I'm saying? We get it. <laughs> I didn't say a word. I just. But I'm just saying, don't judge Russian rap. All I said. Like, all I said. What was your B, Dane? What was your B? Oh, oh, oh right. Okay, the A was. Right the A was crazy. You got you. A was you want to have yourself out loud. No. But the B is is what most people do is you want to try to entertain the room. 
Which is what you always do. That's what you're supposed to do when you get the aux. Right. But what happens is certain things that are entertaining to you are always entertaining to other people. Of course. Of course. That's what so, I so, 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 to me, you're going to always get at least two, at least in the minimum, because the first one might be, I tell you what I want, what I really, really want. And you're like, well, people did like this song. You're just like, ah, it's not a Spice Girl room. You're like, okay, okay, okay. Let me go to back to my bag. Let me go to my... <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Because at one point, yeah. that was the biggest song in the world. I'm going to say this right now for everybody under the sound of our voices. <laughs> I know what you're going to say. I give you the fucking aux and you play Spice Girls, you're done. <laughs> oh, one and done. Oh, when I said one and done, I was bugging, yeah. though. No, no, no. That, no, what? <laughs> what? It's a Dame would, party, Because right? Dame nah, would do, bro. this is how I know Dame would do shit like that. Talk about, I used to DJ. Oh, fucking do. DJ Pyrotech. No, nigga, you thought I forgot your <laughs> yeah. name? Piece of shit. No, <laughs> nigga. No. Shout out to no. you for no, remembering that. No. But no, I, I, but I'm also. Don't, Dame don't get the ox cord ever, bro. Like, you know, he don't never I'm also, get I'm the also ox the, cord. I'm also the weird DJ. Like, I, I want to give you tons of dope shit, but then throw us some shit in there just to fuck you up. Just be like, get the fuck. Is that? Yes. No, no, no gr- granted. You heard what you, you, hear what you just said. You just I'm said gonna Spice tons, Girls. I'm going to give you tons of dope shit. And then sprinkling some wild shit. Then you also said you're gonna start with Spice Girls. That's different. No. You didn't give us tons of nothing. You, you can't come in with, with Spice Girls. No, that's you just said you would. You. you just said no, no, you I would. Didn't, I didn't say I would start. I'm just saying I, I was talking about a person that starts like that versus me. I would never start. No, no, no. I'm taking the aux code if you do that. Like I said, <laughs> I am. Like right now, we can do this cord. if we was together. And it's like, dang, play something. And I'm like, tell me, it's not, 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 Y'all would be you like that, bro. You get smoked, <laughs> smoked bad. Like I said, the aux Matter cord fact, is not. Next time we get the aux cord, I'm going to do that. Just to no, fuck with y'all. And, no, you're and not. Turn the, and turn the car off. <laughs> <laughs> turn the car the off. Car. We're going to cut the whole car off. We're no, going to be on the side of the road in the dark. I'm not playing. <laughs> I'm not get, I'll take an Uber. I'll take the bus. We, I'm not getting in that car. <laughs> Bro, not Every everybody deserves not, not, not everybody deserves the Uber Uber Uber. Uber. You gotta, you know what I'm saying? You gotta curate the vibes for everybody. You gotta do That's some actually, ladies. No, no, it's, it's definitely a social responsibility. You gotta curate yeah, for yeah, the no, ladies. Really? You gotta oh. curate for the thugs. You gotta curate yeah, for the, the weed heads. You gotta curate you for the drinkers. To. You gotta curate yeah. for the dudes who's real quiet in the corner. You well, gotta okay, curate for the loud I, I, motherfuckers. Okay, so I got a better question. What are surefire songs that passes? On the Ox, uh, Drake, like one, one oh, banger, like one banger that you know is going to be one. Oh, that's easy. I got, I got one that's new that works, but go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, bro. I got a new one that works uh, no matter what, no matter what, how you feeling, it works. I already said any I Drake, record. I got a record already, any Drake, but um, we got the Chris Brown, um, no guidance, we got the Chris Brown, um, what the other, the other one with, with, with young, no Thug. guidance is definitely gonna pop no matter what. Yep. The, the no Chris guidance Brown, bumps from what? Chris Brown, Young Thug bumps. That works um, in any crowd. I got yeah. one. I got one. I got one. In any crowd. I got no one right How does that song go? The sure Chris fire. Brown, Young Thug, banger. Um, oh, the, yeah. Chris Brown, Young Thug works. That shit that doesn't work. No, no, no. Bar, 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 he, he already said no guidance. No guidance is going to work no matter what. Wait, I, I, I'm not going to lie. Which, which song is no guidance? Can hum the, him, who, him and Chris Brown and Drake. Okay, okay, got you. I don't be knowing the name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's gonna bump. That's gonna bump no matter what. Also, it like you, you did, you did, you were right, Dame, in terms of what you said. In terms of it depends on where you're located. Yeah. Um, you could play Wizkid's album from start to finish. It don't matter. You could play any part of that shit. That shit. But but to be yeah. honest, Chicago don't do Afro beat. But this is what and, I'm saying. It depends on. And we only do a, a small I'm part talking, of Caribbean music. I'm talking universally. You got one yeah. record to play. You name it. Why are you cheating? You're naming entire artists and their whole albums. No, but I did say I said Chris one. Brown. No guidance. I I did Ooh, start. So with you're them. done. You're done. Dame, go ahead. One record. She'll fire it. I'm gonna give you a, a new one. Um, the shit know. with old, uh Bruno and Anderson Pack, the oh. first one though. The, I ain't playing no games with Bunny yeah. and Dan. It depends on where. Okay. No, no, no. I'm not lying. You, know you, fire, you can leave the door. Depends Literally. on where you at. It depends no, no, no. on where you at. But, I, but I've seen it happen I'm in different ways. Why. 
in a row. Come on. You know what I'm saying it depends on where. I, mean, I agree. No, no, I'm not no. fighting. The reason, I'm no, no, no. The reason I say it doesn't depend on where is because even though it's not, it's literally not the vibe of anywhere. You can be in a house music party. They were like, ooh, gee, ooh, gee, ooh, gee, ooh, gee, ooh, gee, but but here's the thing. Here's the thing but with if the you play though. it, what's going? No, no, I'm just saying. Just to, that song, you'll be mad, like, oh. But once you say, I ain't playing no games in front of I, I, I hear you. But no, I get it, then. But if you're in a car I'm full sorry, of niggas, but this is this is the only caveat. If you're in a car full of niggas, we all gonna sing it. No, we not. You'll be the only nigga not singing. I got a, I got a record. Go ahead. I'm waiting. I got, a one what you got? What you got? I got another one too. Go go hmm? This is how we do it. Hey. I mean, of course. Yeah, this that's, is that's... how we do it. Yo, nah, that's good. Yo, that's ladies good. And gentlemen, ladies and that's gentlemen, good. if you want me on your ox, I got you. That's good. I got bangers over here. That's good. That's good. Um, oh, well, but, but now you, but now you, but okay, I didn't know we was talking like old school, school because I'm, I'm, I'm talking about music. I said one surefire, no matter where I'm at, I could be in fucking Austria, <laughs> I could play that record, it's gonna turn it up, no matter what. I'm not gonna lie, at. because let, let, wait, no, let me tell you, wait, I wait, I'm, I sometimes I just, I just gotta defend my mans, and I want to defend you real quick because I want to tell you, as a, I've been a bootleg DJ in my life. It's mm-hmm. true. That song works absolutely everywhere. And it's crazy because the song that I would pick to rival that would be Poison from uh, Belle Biv DeVoe. But, it, but, it, but I've literally been at a party where a motherfucker played Poison and niggas was like, oh, damn. I've seen it. I'm not going to lie. I've it, seen it, people it, be it, like, face? I got another Bruh. one. I got they was not one. fucking with Poison, but, but, but when they go, this is how we do it. Yeah, that shit work. That one works. That one works. Okay, um, that's, that's gonna bump no matter what. I ain't gonna lie. That's a good one because that be poison. One. I got um. Because I was gonna say poison. I got two, right? I got two. I got once two. again, Maybe. once again, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, this is the song that's gonna rock every party, no matter what. No matter what, though. No matter I what. Got, I got. If you got a song, put it in the comments below. Let's talk about I that. Got, yeah. I got. I got what fab. I got Fab and Lil Mo, Superwoman. The song is fire. It's a bump. Blah, 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 I, I had, that song blah, has blah, blah, never. Blah, 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 blah. I have never blah, seen that song blah, blah, fail in any blah, party. Blah, 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 I have never blah, blah, seen blah, blah, that song fail in any party I've ever been to. No matter where I am in this in this country, that song has bumped everywhere. It has. It has. It has. It has. It has. You such um, a bro- yo. You the most Brooklyn. You more Brooklyn. Jay, this thing is more Brooklyn than you, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I've also been more places than him. He's just been <laughs> okay. Cause. But, it's like but his then, brain. But then I also got. I also. I also have right. But this He's is for like ladies. Fab first, first song. I have also for the ladies, right? Can I? Can I say <laughs> my second one? Go ahead. For but the you don't get how Bro- you the most Brooklynist nigga I know. Is I could have said Jay Z. That's mad Brooklyn, but I didn't. I could have said you don't know. That's another one that I've never seen fail either. But that's not what I was gonna you say. Don't know. No, but that's not by Jay Z. Universal. That's you talking about hip hop club. That's hip hop. No, I've never if seen that feel in a, anywhere. If you in a reggae club, they bumped that. In, I've never seen. First off, no whole song fails in any club I've seen ever. I, in I, I'm, New York, nigga, you I ain't never been to a reggae club in Chicago. But fine, you ain't never but been to a reggae fine, club in Atlanta. Right. First off, y'all don't got you no reggae about? clubs in Chicago. Don't do that. What yes, reggae club do. y'all got in goddamn we, Chicago? We got the Wild Hair. The Wild Hair is where they went to in Love Jones, the movie where he was. Dance no, no, you're wrong. Bro, you're wrong. Chill out, bro. That was the reggae club. That was not in Chicago. That shit was probably in Indiana. Love that Jones was in that Chicago. Shit. No, no, no. Anyway, right, I'm about to do that because now we. Yeah. Um, what's the other? I just had you lost. You can't play that. No, because I was talking about a. I was saying a girl song, a up tempo woman song. Fuck you, fuck me. Beyonce. No, it was an A Marie song. Oh, the her biggest it's song. One thing. <laughs> One that was thing. another one. That's chick. One That's thing another. works. There I've you heard go. that never fail in a in a club, especially for one hundred percent. One hundred percent. Cool. That's Play my one other thing. one. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm gonna tell you why that fails. If me one thing fails, one thing is fire. If I'm in a car, I love that song. If I'm that in a car with four niggas and one thing plays, we I am screaming. Play. I'm screaming my lungs out. This just one thing I'm, that got I'm me sorry. tripping. That song I'm is not. fire. I'm not. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not. You're wildin'. He's wildin'. Oh, oh, oh. He's wildin'. 
That right. song is fire. All right. All right. I, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. As as a, as a producer, as Get a person, who, wait, wait, real quick, real quick. That's as a person fire. who sampled that song, I gotta disagree with you. I'm sorry, nah, bro. Because because I'm gonna tell you why. Because that's it's like it's it's kind of like I see your one thing, and when I'm gonna throw you, I'm gonna throw you Beyonce. All about you. You're the I mean, one I love. I would never fight that. I, would never fight that. I, I would never swear fight that. to God on my life, every time you I, hear that I song, fight that. Um, we all just be like, <laughs> "Oh, I got another one." I'm, yeah. I'm not bumping this one thing in the in the. In the, in the I got, no, I got no, 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 no. But I used to. Nah. But if but if but if the Beyonce joint niggas always be like, "You, we, yeah, you know, we, lo- it's a good song." And, and I got another one again. You got another. Okay. You got another one, Willa of Dame. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so I, I'm gonna ask the question: Are we dragging this right now? <laughs> or do you want to move on? To I'm just having fun. We are dragging it, but I'm just having fun. <laughs> I'm having fun because you got me thinking of just seriously songs that like you got it with this. Is how we do it. it. Nah. You got it. We drag it. Oh, what about tag team? Because now we gonna make me corny. You gonna make me pull out all of the MTV, you know, the fucking CDs. I, Nigga, I, I, 19, I, I, Willa, do you got do you got another one, Willa? Yeah, I want to talk. I I personally want to talk about. Um, Can we get into something real? Because we, we, we going. I want to talk about do? fucking um, Trick Daddy. Shot his, callers, his, his, his. brawlers. Wait, Benjamin. Benjamin. All about the Benjamin's work. You got gotcha. you. Like Not that he beat you, but I'm saying it. Like, no, no, all about the Benjamin's work. All about the I've Benjamin's work. I've never seen that not work yes, ever. I agree. All about the Benjamin's works. I agree with that. Wayne said more money, more problems. In anywhere. Wayne said more. Wayne said, Wayne said more money, more problems, which I agree with as well. You can do both. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yo, work. that record is fire. I work okay, every so we got it. Yo, Wayne. Wayne said juicy. Wayne said juicy. Juicy. No, 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 no. You, you know what's funny? I've been in a party and juicy did not work. You've seen it not work. It was so bad. What Boogie wow. said? There was a Biggie song I know works all the time. Well, Biggie is Biggie, but it was another Mind you, song Ju- Juicy should work universally. Sure. I have been in a party where Juicy... Oh, that Biggie freestyle. Everything. Biggie's, um... I've heard Biggie's freestyle. Always nah, always but we, we know the... But, but real quick, we know the Benjamin's work. And that's the that's that's why I like this conversation, because it's like certain songs. All about this the Benjamin's like, work. No all about the Benjamin's. It works. This is how we do it. Yes, it works. I seen Poison fail, but I'm gonna still put that in the list to me because once pop, 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 Superwoman pop, works. Superwoman works. That has never failed ever. You know ever. I, okay, so I too can say that I've never seen Superwoman fail, but at the same time, I haven't been into many parties outside of New York where they played Superwoman. Yeah. So th- that's why it's different for me. No, they played it. We was in Miami. They played it and it worked. But Miami is New York, man. It's the same thing. It's a hub. Whole it's bunch a, of New York niggas in Miami. It's like we all fly down from Brooklyn to Miami, nigga. Damn, 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 damn. Like, damn. Listen, it works. It's the same shit. Listen, my man got it's that the is w. my shit though, baby. Yeah. And then my shoulder get to get to doing this. <laughs> my shoulder get to doing some weird shit. Right. Yeah. So let's talk about some real shit, y'all, before we, you know. But getting your booty I ain't? really, I really enjoy this conversation. Getting no, your booty? No, the conversation was real. I wanted, I wanted, I want to introduce to the to the to the panel okay. some some shit that Trick Daddy has been saying for years. Years, what, by the way. Years, years. It's nothing new. But he was on the uh, um, drink uh, champs. Oh, drink, drink champs. Drink champs. Yeah, yeah. He was on the drink champs, and he said some shit. I would like to play it for y'all, and we could just talk about it. Work. How y'all feel? That works. Let's listen.
tight grip. You don't have your legs in the air, though. It depends. <laughs> <laughs> Trick Daddy. <laughs> oh, shit, that's funny. Okay, Trick so... Daddy the OG. Eat the booty gang. We already know Eat the booty. Yo, Eat the booty gang been around for a long time. Yeah. We've been talking about it for a long time. He's been talking about what fellas is involved with the Eat the booty gang. Now he's saying they are openly recruiting women to be a part of the Eat the booty gang. And Trick Daddy openly said that he has lifted his legs up and got his booty ate. We got to so talk about it. So, you know, as you know, if you are a freak and watch of this show, we've had this conversation with our lovely... But you got to eat the booties like, like grocery. Damo I'm has saying, gone I, on record. I, I, I want to... I want the, the reason why I want to talk about it, because as soon as he said that, I was like, oh, shit. Gabrielle Union is in Eat a Booty Gang now. Because now... now Oh yeah, she ate Dwayne Wade booty. You ain't know that? Yeah, she said that. What? She said it. Yeah. And oh, she, I didn't know that. She, yeah, she she actually said it. Yeah, yeah. She, oh, she okay. Did. That's very yeah. yeah. you know? okay. Mm-hmm. Fair enough. One D- thing is, I, what D Wade didn't deny it either. So, also, but, B- Biblical, Fox, Biblical Fox ain't fit these booty. Yeah, yeah, he 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 oh. man, yeah yeah. So, yo, my it's thing like, is like yo yo, yo it's going reckless out here. Like okay, right? What you got to say, bar? Like. We had this conversation on the show already, right? Of course. We keep having this because this booty thing just keep coming up. <laughs> I didn't bring it up. I didn't bring it up, okay? I did not bring it up. Blame Willow this time. It wasn't me. Blame me? Blame Trick Daddy. But you brought, it, you brought it to the show. You ain't have to bring it to the show. The interview was two days ago. What was I supposed to do? Yeah, it's the we latest interview. interview. Listen, it's anyway. not me. Go ahead. What's your point, man? My thing is, right, as a man, like I don't I don't know. Like where is it okay to like if you like getting your booty ate, that's fine. I, I don't judge you because I'm a non judgmental individual. Trust so for me. the record, you've never had it. No, 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 no. Okay, no, all right. So then boom, give me the pain. Right. Willa, have you have you gotten your booty ate? We I feel no, we did no, this no, with no. Dan, we had this whole conversation last time. <laughs> But but the people there that the people that were there last time they're not here now. So let's okay, talk yeah. about. It. I never <laughs> got my set booty ate. Set the Ooh. record straight. Set the record straight. Willa, have you gotten your booty ate? No, sir. Cool. Damo, have you gotten your booty ate? Hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Multiple times. <laughs> I didn't know. I thought it was what. Wait. What? No. <laughs> what? Yo, what? No. I no. Same girl. <laughs> No, 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 because the way, the way, the way the, you said it was once, said it was a one time. <laughs> no, like, I just, I just tell you the introduction. Oh. oh, so she was, oh, she was blessing you long time. In the booty game. Why is this a story? I didn't know that, I, you no, know, no, that no, I wouldn't no, even. Right, no, it's, fault, it's, it's, it's legit a story because you didn't tell us this happened multiple times. Nah, you times. didn't tell us about that. You, you made it seem like it was a one time thing. It's like, oh well, shit, you're doing that. Okay, I kind of like it. Well, all right. So, no, no. So that one girl that did it, who called into the show a couple years ago when we had this conversation, right? Um, she, she said on the show, I, I won't say her name, but y'all know. Remember, she called in and she was like, "Hell yeah, I be niggas booty and all that shit." Niggas, she, niggas, not demos. Right. But at the end of the day, I, I was like, "I'm one of the niggas, I guess," because you did it oh, to me oh, too. Oh, so, so question. And this is this is an honest question. This is real. Yeah, and I'm, not, I'm not cracking no jokes. I I really yeah, want to talk to him. Approximately, to approximately how many times in your life have you had this happen? She definitely did more than twice. So probably three, and then there was a one time with another chick, and it was a, it was not that, but it was like the the whole surprise. <laughs> no, nah, because I'm with the surprise. The surprise, like whoa, whoa, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I'll probably say four times. Probably four times for me. Probably four times. Because old girl went in. And I was like, oh, this is what you do. Okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, think of this. Apparently. But she also, for the as they laugh, everyone, she also Whoa! called in and told us that this is what she does. Like, Yo, I just want you to know, Dame, Wade's face. Off the- <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, Wade's face right now. Yo. But wait, we was talking about it as a subject, and she legitimately called in and defended herself. But you didn't say you no, got no, it. but not against you. We, this is the first time that we, we 
okay, so when she called in, she said, yes, I do it to niggas. Right. She never said, yes, I do it to Damo. It's different now. And then, and then you didn't say, yo, A, hey, check this out. This is a multiple time thing. You know what I'm saying? Facts. Well, no, but, but that's just smart. Not, you know, you don't put your I'm, shit out there like that. You know, I, I, okay, can I, can I, can I ask like no nasty you know, relax, shit, right? Whatever. What, 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 how does it, how, like, what does it feel like to get your butt ate, bro? Like, what is the urge? Yeah, I really want to, I mean. No, like, I'm, li- I'm intrigued because I don't want my butt ate, but it's like, what, what will make a man like. Now I've I've heard multi, I've heard multiple times over that the male's G spot is in the butt. I've heard right. that. That's I don't I know it to be true or not, but I've heard that. I I heard the same thing. Here's what happened, man. And yeah, if, and that, if that, you that. really want, if we really want to have this conversation, it's real. And and I'm, open. And I'm not shit. And I'm not shit faced. You open. Um, I'm open to the conversation. <laughs> I'm not shit faced, so it's cool. So I can have it without it being ridiculous. Um, to be honest. Things fitted around with your ass feel great, but we're so wrapped in masculinity to where we mm. can't deal with it. And I'm not even upset that a man can't deal with it, like because I get that. It's like because oh, that means gay, gay. This we we so wrapped in gay, gay, gay. Mm-hmm. But it's like low key. If you just learn more of your body, you literally can learn how to have better orgasms and better things but we just feel like it's all gay and it's like well it's gay if it's a nigga fucking your ass that's gay but it's not gay if this is your wife and you're learning her too we gonna be together can forever we, you're we literally a learning step at a time we're <laughs> literally you about to pause me to death even though no, I'm, no, I'm, no, no, I'm, no, no. i wasn't like, gonna say pause I, no i wasn't gonna say pause not I'm for real saying. because i'm really trying to bro we listen we live one life. You got one body, bro. And so it's like explore your entire body. And women, if you get the right woman, is okay with exploring your whole body. And if you're okay, explore her whole body versus having your whole... Imagine if a woman said, uh, don't suck my titties because I don't, I don't like my titties and I think that's where you like titties. Then that's, that's, so, that's what you don't like. So I'm, I'm just trying to give you a real... That's what I'm saying. I'm just trying to be honest. What happens is as men, we don't explore our whole bodies because we have this thing about being gay. Now, you're only gay if you you date men. <laughs> like you like men. But if you like women, what's wrong with exploring your body? You explore a sister's body. Okay. I hate to make I, I, it real, but I know I'm, I ain't I'm drunk not. Yet. Listen, 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 right? I I, I. Jesus. Sorry. Got a little heartburn, right? I understand what you're saying, right? But it's it, you know, I I always say sex is more is more of a mental thing than it is a physical thing. For me, is I don't it? know about any for me, for me, I don't know about it. I can only speak on anybody. I only have sex with myself and whomever gives me the opportunity to have sex with them. So right? so, so so real quick, let my fault. I'm gonna cut you off only because of this, because when old girl. Legitimately lick my ass straight up. Sorry, it sounds crazy, right? Let's laugh. I'll wait. I'll pause for the laughter. But when she did it, <laughs> I'll pause for the laughter. I'll pause. Nah, it's Wade, bro. Nah, Wade is hate shit. Bro. <laughs> Probably Wade my first, cause you know. Yo, Wade all right, my fault, my fault, my fault. Nah, nah, but wait, but and that's what I'm saying. It's a real moment for me when it happened. It fucked up what I thought about everything that I thought, right? Because we all think what we think, right? Mm-hmm. So it happened, and I was like, "Huh." So I liked how that felt, but I don't need. I'm not attracted to men. I was like, "It's a woman doing this." So I was like, I, "I had a whole moment, y'all, like a legit whole moment with yourself." Because the same reason why you would giggle about it. It's the same reason I, I'm nigga, you know, I make mad jokes. So it happened and I was like, Yo, this nigga. Is this weird? I was like, but So my question but is, this would, girl you have I'm it fucking is would you have her would you have a girl do it again? It's not something that I ask for. I, I'm not looking would for you it. Would you have a girl do it again? But if it was done, it felt good. So uh, niggas want good things to happen. <laughs> so, so, would you, would, you, 
Would you assist by holding your legs up? No. No. Uh, I'm just asking. I'm no, just no. Asking. no, no, no. Because that's just weird. <laughs> What's funny, bro? I'm asking. Y'all say, funny. yo, he's laughing and spitting and silence. Yo, What's going on with you, bro? Yo, somebody get Barry's asthma pump. I'm asking a question, bro. I'm asking. So, okay, so you, you're not you're not gonna assist by holding your leg up, right? No, nah, it's just weird. <laughs> Okay. And, I'm not, and I'm not shaped like that. I'm not that. <laughs> and I'm not shaped like that. <laughs> Nigga, even, even if I tried, my legs wouldn't even do that. I'm too old for that shit. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. Nigga, what? Yo, okay. I mean, it felt crazy, good. It wasn't boy. the best shit I've ever had. It felt good. So oh, I, 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 shit. I'm not a person that runs from things that feel good with a person who I fuck with. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't... Mm. I don't feel like you that you you the a ass though. No, the fuck I have not. Nigga, that tongue has slipped. No, it, it has not. Bro, the pussy in the. No, it's not. Word. I'm telling you, I've never ate ass, bro. Well, honestly, no matter how y'all feel about it, I put the thumb in the butt. Of course, absolutely. Come on now. Low key, I wish that it would. Ha- I wish that you would just experience it. So that you no, understand no, it. Yo, yo, nah, dude. Yo, no, dude. Yo, no. Nah, wait. No. You got yo. Y'all gotta see Wade's face, bro. I don't. I don't care if I listen. I don't care if I'm throwing the room off. It's just one of those people. I, yo, get Dame off the ox court, okay? This is the ox. <laughs> yo, Wade is over here dying, right, dog. Right. Like this nigga said. But, I hope but you know what's what? so, But you know what's so crazy? And and, and all right. So let me just say real quick. I really feel like men have this thing where we're, we're trying to be so masculine mm. that, like, you you don't even understand things about your own body. Like, it's crazy to me. Like, like thumb up your butt. Okay, so can I rebuttal that? Like, that's wild to me, bro. Can, can I rebuttal that? Please. Yeah, please talk to me. So the way I would like to rebuttal that is just by using the same verbiage that was used in your statement that you had said. Right. You're saying men are so masculine that we can't even fathom that, right? Yeah, you can't even think about it. Like What I'm saying is, what if men are just masculine and it's not a normal thing for a masculine being? Wait, what? I'll say it again. Yeah, because that wasn't enough. Your, your argument is men are so masculine. You're so manly. You're mm-hmm. so manly that you don't get it. I'm saying yeah. what if men are just masculine? What does that mean? So, I'm not so nothing. I'm not hyper masculine. I'm not overly yeah. masculine. I'm, I'm not, not la, 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 la. I'm not none of that. I'm just I'm none of that. a man. I know that for right. a fact. That. And that is just not normal for me. So, so things that are not normal does not mean that it's not masculine. Granted, but what you're saying is. We are so afraid of not being. You know what I'm saying, like, you're, I, I was He's going, going off I, of your I, premise. Your I, I was going premise. off of your premise. Your premise is the extreme, right? So I, I just wanted to do the reverse of your extreme, just so we yeah. can have this honest conversation. Sure, sure, sure. And if, if I'm losing people, I apologize, but I'm literally just playing off of your words. Okay. What if I'm not so masculine? What if I'm just a regular guy? I just, I'm, I'm, I'm a regular masculine man. You can't take away from the fact that I have masculinity because I'm a male. Okay, yeah, sure. But what, but what if I'm not so masculine? I'm just regular, and I don't yeah, fuck I don't with it. Wanna... Yeah. That's it. I don't fuck with it. No, nope, it, it's not I'm me. I'm gonna. Eat, I mean, wait, wait, Dame. I'm sorry, and I'm gonna even piggyback off of what Willis saying. Right, like I said. Yeah. What if I don't see any pleasure in me getting my ass licked? But you or... can't see it because you. It, no, you can't listen, see listen. Pleasure, when I my say. Dude. What See, I'm saying, pleasure? You're missing what I'm saying. You're talking about, have you ever had your toes sucked? Wait, 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 wait. That shit feels Dame, great. Dame, you can't Dame, see Dame. it. Dame, no, but bro, it's something that I don't want to experience. I have, okay, for but example, just, right? But, but, but I'm you gonna, might I'm just gonna meet that type I'm of... Gonna, I'm going to give screaming. an example. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to give an example, right? I've had my toes sucked before. Oh, a vulnerable moment on Willow Wednesdays. I didn't like it. Okay, but you so don't wait, like things that are opposite of what you think. You didn't like cheese pizza in Chicago. Damn. You the I, wrong but, nigga to talk to about this. Bro, you're over talking no. him. Can he finish? Bro, but my point with what I'm saying is you just said the shit feels good. Like 
You said you liked your toe suck. You just said this shit feels great, right? I had an experience and I didn't like it. Right? Cool. Now, what I'm saying is, for me, sex is not a thing that is just, is mostly a physical thing. If <laughs> mentally I'm not there to try something like that or want something like that, I know I'm not going to like it. If I can see it like, oh, okay, my foot in her mouth, oh, yeah, that gets me off. Then I'm going to want to, I'm going to pursue that. It's just like, yo, me yo, thinking about... Were, were your toenails cut at least? Oh no! Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, you your whole foot in your mouth, bro. I wasn't it, bro. I, on God, I, I check this out. I wasn't That's expecting funny. it. Like we was chilling. Yeah. And then your getting, foot was in her mouth, bro. Bro, I was <laughs> get, I was getting some like, I was getting probably top two head of my life, like, and not number two. Like, so I, okay, so I automatically know who you're talking about. Keep going. Right? So, That's crazy. so getting getting some brain, then all of a sudden, my it's not all of a sudden, bro. Bro, my <laughs> legs is like this. My bro, legs is like dick, this. Your dick to your. Foot I'm gonna to explain it to you. Foot. I'm gonna explain it to you. She, no, she, but you said, she you picked my sudden. foot up and then she licked the. <laughs> Like she licked the whole bottom of my heel and my foot, and I said, "What oh, are you?" So you had dust on it from the floor. <laughs> so okay. I said, "Yo, what are you doing?" And then you she need legit. Some flops on. You need some so flops then she on, she sucked the big toe, and I said, "I'm gonna need you to relax." I gotta pee. My bad. I'm, I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all kidding me? I gotta pee. You know what I'm saying? So she licked it, and then she sucked the big toe, and I said, crazy. "Yo, what's up with you? That's not okay." She's like, "Oh, you didn't like that?" I said, "No, I did not like that." No, I did not like that. Like this is what I'm saying today. Dave talking about oh masculine men. No, I know if I knew I don't like my I knew I've been knew I didn't want my feet sucked, toes sucked. And then she did it and it proved my point. That so you don't have to play with my butt for me to know if I like it or not. I don't like the shit. No, I, I I agree with you. You understand? Know That's why I say sex is I a agree. mental thing for me, much as much as it is a physical thing. If I don't see, if I don't see myself, oh, get, yo, bro, sex is definitely mental. But this if, is my if point. I'm not, if, if I'm not in it, it's not gonna happen. But this is my point. So now I don't but, get but, off about my butt getting played with. That's why I'm like, you okay. Know, you know what's funny? You know what's funny? That happens to us as we get older. It really does because when you're younger. Any kind of arousal, you just boom. Lit. What's up? Now, if my As mind I, is not if, there, if, if I if I don't vibe with you, if I don't connect, it's probably not gonna happen. Because sex is sex. Shit happened so many times in my life. I, I can just speak for me. It's happened so many times in my life that now I need a connection. I need a vibe. I need something else. Yo, you want to know what's so crazy? I said it's gonna make me get off because if having- not, it's not gonna happen. Yo, you wanna know how real this conversation we have it now? I was having this conversation with a coworker, right? And I said, yo, that statement when you know in movies when men say it's not you, it's me. I didn't understand that statement so much till now in my life. Yo. People used to be like, that statement is so oh, that state people be like, that's such a fucking stupid statement. It's so full of shit. It's bullshit. It's not stupid. It's not now that this my age now, son, it's that real. statement. Makes so much sense to the point where it's like, yo, bro, why did we crucify bro, niggas for saying that? If you throw it off, it's not gonna happen. Baby, bro, I'm sorry. It's not you, bro, it's me. If, if you're thrown off, if your day was fucked up, if you lost your job and lost your mother, and whatever, no matter what happens, y- yes, sex might be a physical thing, but it's also a chemical thing. And if your brain is off, it's not happening. My dick not getting hard. Because I don't fuck with it right now. I'm not fucking with this right now. Yo, and that shit, and that no, shit translates. No, like, yo, this, this, this conversation isn't had, bro. I swear to it's God, not had. Di- yo, I, and we took it from sex to actual relationships, right? I said to a, I was talking to this girl, my this lady at my job, and I said, yo, as a man, sometimes I can see how a man can dub a girl that's a good girl for the simple fact that he knows that she's such a good girl and he doesn't want to waste her time. A mature man, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So 
So he knows that he's on fuck shit. You know, he knows he's out here fucking other joints, doing whatever he's doing. And show these decent. That happens all the time. But this is my point. So now it alludes back to the point of me saying, yo, it's not you, it's me. Because remember, growing up, hearing a nigga say, yo, it's not you, it's me. People used to make fun of it like that was the dumbest, <laughs> right, dumbest yeah, statement, yeah. Yeah. statement in the world. Yeah. It was horrible. If somebody's saying that to you, they just lying because they don't want to make the excuse of really answer right. you. But yeah. now at my age right now that I'm at and I'm dealing with everything <laughs> I'm dealing with, yeah. yo, that shit makes yo, so chill out much Delta variant. Relax. Work. Okay. But that shit makes so much sense now, bro. Yeah. If I, my mind is not here mentally to fuck you, I'm, I, my dick not going to get hard, baby. It's not you, it's me. If I don't want to fuck with you that's, no more because... That's so fucking real and it's because crazy. That's not said. I don't want to fuck yeah. with you no more because simple fact that I know that you go, you you cool peoples, but I know I'm a fuck sh- I'm a fuck nigga, and because I'm a right. fuck nigga, you cool peoples. I don't want to violate you no more. So you know what? Even you know though what? you like me so much, it's not you, it's me, shorty. Every no, once in not. a while, yo, bro. Every once in a while, wow. Every once in a while, we, we got tap, it. We tap. We tap into something that's so real. I've never heard that said on camera before. That is pr- and, that and, statement. And, honest, and, and and for the viewers, for the people watching us, if you've heard it before, please comment below. Let me know so I can hear it. But what Loki, he, Loki, can you say it again? No, I was saying to Willow, we were talking late, about. You came late to the party talking about saying it again. He said that's, it twice yeah. already. That, that's when, the reason why I'm asking. Well, we were we were talking about um, we were talking about the anal sex situation and playing, right, right. getting there, well, yeah, 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 yeah. and I was saying that What'd we were say? talking about how sex is mental just as much as it is physical. And I yeah. said, you know what's so crazy is that a lot of times if I'm mentally not there, I can't do it. And I said, yo, this, this alludes to a conversation I was having, having with a coworker where I said, yo, sometimes if I'm just not there and I'm not okay, it's not going to happen. So it brings up this conversation of, hey, you know what? It don't got nothing to do with you. You could be amazing, dope, fire, right. fucking sexy as shit. But if I'm not okay, if I'm not Gucci, I'm not valid, it's just not, it's me. And it's my fault. And I'm blaming me. And I'm sorry, but I, we can't do this because of me. But but as a man, as a man, we're judged. You know what's crazy? Everything always resort, resorts back to sex. Right? Yeah. Because now as a man, if you can't perform. It's two things. Yo, yo, it, this is the first things. time we're talking about erectile dysfunction. Oh. Oh. Mm-hmm. Let's get it. Cool. So, as a man, if you can't perform, you're looked at as lesser than. Mm-hmm. Ooh. But there's so many factors that can factor into the fact that you can't perform at this point in time. That's a fact. Health, one. <laughs> Being in shape. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not even... I'm, yes, cool. I'm, but I'm talking about you had a fucked up day. Mm-hmm. Right. You just had a fucked up day all around. Yep. If, you, if you're a coffee drinker, your coffee was fucked up. You went to work. Your boss was bitching at you. Oh, oh there, there it go. go. Oh, there it go. You said the B word. Let's I go. I'll I take my shot. Um, but yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like it's just been a long line of things that has affected your day negatively. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then you come home and your wife wants. Like, hey, dick. what's up? I want. I'm ready dick. for you. And you like, oh, babe, I, it's been not a today. terrible day. I can't. Not today. It's been a terrible day. All around. Now, what's going to happen is either A, you about to give some sloppy dick that's nasty with the gummy worm. It's going to be terrible. You're not going to be proud of it. Or B, it's just not going to happen. And And then what happens is you're looked at as less than a man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, can I... I want to salute you for bringing up that point because to be honest... No, no, just... it's real because we've never talked about it. No, no, but the, I, all I want to do is agree, nigga. Relax. <laughs> um, I'm not yelling at you. You're not. I'm not you're not. You're not. You're not. You're not. It's probably me because I'm getting drunk. But at the end of the day, see? See? Yeah. no, no. But at the end of the day, I've never heard that even be spoken about. No, I um, yo, women, yo. women do women women judge men on their libido. Yes. How big and hard your dick is. How large. You know how long you can go. How. how how if you make them come, if you make them not. But yet a woman can legitimately be like, I'm not in the mood. And it's okay. And it's okay. 
And as a man, we have to just accept. Well, you know what? You probably had a busy day. I'm horny as fuck, but it's cool. I'm going to go rub one off in the bathroom or whatever. However that works. Dude, so whatever is, man, whatever like, men do or this whatever. This is why I'm saying so. But, yo, no, that's wild. No, no. no why I, I well, said. I just walked back in. But I'm going to just say that that's a real thing. Like, that's something that's never talked about. Bro. Men never get to just be like, I'm tired too. But this is why I'm saying Fuck. I, I had this long ass day. Yeah. I had this conversation with a coworker. Ooh, 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 ooh. My bad. He's you don't back. Know what happened? Put him on the camera. Wait. Put him no. on the camera. <laughs> you, you, you know what happened? <laughs> sorry, I'm Barry. Barry, Barry, I'm sorry. 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 I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. But you know sorry. what happens? Wait, 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 what happens? You know what happens? Your sexuality gets questioned. Oh, you're cheating. Oh, you're cheating. That, that, this is what I was going to do. Now, oh, 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 so you don't want to have sex? Are you gay? Right. But this is, but wow. You don't want to this? But this is, but listen to me. This is what. Yo, so, this, 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 this false bravado that men have to carry all the time is fucking nuts because we can't be human at times. I'm playing uh, too. I had a shitty day too. This also, <laughs> but this is alluding as well, to, right? right. All this is together, what I'm and it alludes to what I I had the conversation, That's and when funny. I said it to my coworker, she looked at me and she was like, "Why? What do you mean it? It? Because like I said, I said, yo, excuse me, it's not you, it's me.' And I, like I said, I've translated to relationships, to sex, to whatever it is, financial reasons." In all aspects that it can be used in, I translated it to that, and they were like, "She was, she was like," and then somebody else came along and said, "No, nah, that's bullshit," because at the end of the day, men, all y'all want to do is have sex, and I'm like, and I said, I said, "Yo, it, that's not the case. Sometimes, legit, as a man, you just be so tired from doing so much that all you want to do sometimes is come home and just sit down and just scratch your head, get a plate we're of food, to be human, bro. and just chill." I said, but because, Listen, but because, be pe- because you've been preconditioned to think that a man is supposed to be one rudimentary way when it comes on the shit all the time, you now, when you see a man and you, and you realize like, hey, this nigga really, I, I say Ma- all the time, right? Men, women, when, when women see men or they get a man in their life, they automatically think of a man as supposed to, he's supposed to be Superman. He don't never get tired. He don't never break. He don't never fall. He don't never fold. His pockets never run out. None of this shit. He's a he's an old he's an unlimited ATM. He's an unlimited strength man. He's an unlimited smart man. He <clears> fixes <throat> all issues all the time, all day, every day, twenty four seven. Can I? Can so I? Now can the I moment. Tag, I just want to tag on to that real quick and say, yes, yeah, Superman. But I said this before, y'all know we got a whole thing about it. You want him to be your dad. But this is what I'm saying. Your so dad. now, so so Superman, the same way you say, but I still got to be. Holding you, grabbing you, picking you up. Fucking, you ain't fucking your dad. But you understand what I'm saying? No, of I gotta course. be intimate when you want to get intimate. I gotta be. So, yeah. yes, I fuck with you, bro. Hell yeah. Talk to so me. So now, so now, because, and it's so crazy because I had this conversation today with a young lady. And, um, sorry. When women see that and they finally realize that a man is human, it's like, shit, okay, what the fuck? Like, this nigga don't mm-hmm. do everything that he's supposed to, like, I'm th- I thought he's supposed to do. Now, when you realize this nigga's human, women automatically come into the thinking that they have to do so much to fix us to become this man that they thought we were supposed to be. So, ooh, can I... Can, let, so now, let, with, let, wait, wait. So now, with that thought process, they think that they I'm have to carry... I'm, they have I'm to moving. carry so much when it comes on to men. Yo, because we were watching a movie and she said, yo, men have to... Men don't understand how much women, how much we women have to do to help you and hold you down and support you and carry you. And I'm like, how much do you think that you have to do to carry a man that much? She's like, yo, you guys don't realize that you guys are so broken off the bat that you got, we have to do so much to help fix you. Mm. And I'm like, I, I can't, if you I, don't, but, I understand but, that. That's, but that's, that's deep. Right. But then what I said to her was maybe you're looking at it different. Maybe you need to stop looking at us as being so, so much of this and accept us for who we are. Like I said last week. Accept us for where we at and stop thinking that there's so much to do to make us better instead of just taking us where we at and allowing us to, to grow and the grace to fully mm-hmm. move in the way we're supposed to move. Can, can I move the goalpost? Mm-hmm. Go ahead. So, 
this concept comes from the jaded version we have of our parents. Right? Yes, I said I'm on the goalpost. Love the face. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Because here's, here's what I'm going to ask you to bring it back home. How old were you when you realized your parents, mom or dad, when you realize it, they kind of, wow, you're not, you're not God or God. Wow. Okay. Early. So you regular too, mama. You regular five. too, daddy. About wow. Five. five, about four, five. five That's six. what I'm saying. I'm, I'm moving the goalposts, but I'm just about trying five, to get y'all to rock with my thought about process. Five, six. Five, six for you? That's early. That's early, fam. I ain't gonna lie. That's very early. Yeah, five, six. My mom was still God at six. I was a... I was a teenager, damn near early teens, when I realized that my mom was fucking up because I saw her fucking up. I'm like, okay, <laughs> you're wild. Okay. Yeah, it was about five, six. Yeah. So you've been bitter your whole life. So that's I get no, it's it. Not bitter. It's not bitter. No, it's just you just see six. shit. No, but you was younger I, than than Jay, bro, Lil Jay. You was so my mom. My mom had a bad yeah. divorce. My mom had a bad divorce when I was five, six. You know what I'm saying? And then after the bad divorce, we got kicked out of the house that she had a bad divorce in at five or six. And she didn't know what to do. And we was little, we was homeless at five or six. You know what I'm saying? So her working and not being able, I saw it early. So it's like, damn, my right. mom can't do as much as she would yeah. like to do. So everybody's experience. Yeah, okay. You had a yeah, very young good. experience. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, that, that's a, that, that is a very young experience. That's very young, bro. Nah, my, my, parents, my parents. She got her uh, superpowers back, though, later, but. <laughs> but um, yeah, that, that's a that, that's a very young experience, honestly. And yeah. for, you to, for you to for you to remember it, I know it was traumatizing. Cause we talking that's because first grade. Yeah. My, shit, my mom and my dad they divorced when I was seven. You talking about five? You went five, through five, that? Six, <laughs> yeah, five, that is crazy, bro. Yeah. Okay. Five, it was seven. Five, it was seven five, for me six. too. It was seven for me too. Yeah, <clears throat> about five, six. Yeah. When I was seven, so that's when, that's when I saw some shit. But I still five, didn't six. see my mom crack until I was like, five, like I said, teenage. I was in high school, and I was like, oh my, you're welling. That's what you want. That's great. yeah. Because I could like I can see it. I can yeah. It wasn't more so that I understood, but it like in terms of um. Oh, yeah, when you found and out, so so when you found out your mama was not Superwoman, mind yeah, it was five. Six. Everybody's was mom, five, six, yeah, six. That's yeah, that's, that's, she, early, that's early, bro. That's early, okay, think about it right. like this, right? Wow. She wanted to. That's early as shit. Full transparency, right? My mom, my I have my mom had me with my father. Didn't yeah. work out with him. Then she. That's got how you was born. That's how it happens normally, right. of course. And then <laughs> we got, and then she married somebody else, but the individual she married. They were beefing every day, left, right, front, and center. <clears throat> and you took the other nigga side? Who, me? No. Well, because you said he was five, six. Like, fuck that. Five, He's six. right, mama. I no, hate you. No, my grandmother was living us. <laughs> my grandmother, okay, my grandmother was, we were living in a, a home. <laughs> with like, my grandmother lived in the crib with us. It was my grandmother's crib. And instead of my grandmother taking her daughter's side, my grandmother took his side. So then she told my mother to get out. And my mom didn't have nowhere to go. So because of that, my mom was trying to do shit. She was trying to do shit with little money. You know what I'm saying? So she was trying to make right. shit work and it couldn't happen. And I'm there listening to her trying to make shit work. And because she couldn't make shit work because you're trying to make a you're trying to make a hundred dollars out of fifteen cents. And it's like what what there's only so much you could do. So yeah. it's like, damn, she falls short here and falls short there. And then people are like, yo, what the fuck? I, you owe me this. And she's like, yo, I'm sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me. You know what I'm saying? So Hearing it is like, damn, yo, she 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 not holding true to her word to people that she was supposed to do. So that's what that's, I mean. That's like, that's just crazy that you can you you can recall that at the yeah yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah I ain't gonna lie, that's dude. That's, that, that's, that, that's all I'm thinking. I'm just like, you remember this at five? Oh no, and yeah, you have, a great, you have a great memory if you can remember that at the age of five. Oh yeah, yeah, that's I remember. Crazy. We had a red '98 Toyota Camry. That yo, he know the year. Oh, the year a, making model, get the I fuck out of here, Barry. It was a I'm not going, bro. You had to, nah, you had to look at some you, pictures. You want me tell you how really? I'm, I'm gonna tell you how really was. It was a red toy, red '98 Toyota Camry. My mom had to open the door from the driver's side because the lock on the drop the, from the passenger side side because the driver's side the, the the lock stopped working. 
That's why you know I'm saying. I remember that. I remember one time she she got uh, she she got drenched right. in the rain because the shit. Yeah, mad shit. But I do remember that for sure. So 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 once again. So once again. I do remember being young. I do remember the age. I remember first and second grade. I remember all of that. But you remember losing the superwoman and your mom mm-hmm. at five or six? That's crazy to me. Yeah, that's that's to me. To me, that's a bit early, but everybody's situation. I mean, it, when I was six, my mama was, you know what I'm saying? My daddy is still Superman. My mom was Wonder Woman. Like, I don't have no, you know, these are my parents. Right now, Jay's son, you, Jay, your actual son, believes that you're a Superman. Yeah. Period. Yeah. He's not like, fuck out of here, daddy go through his shit. He are, no, he don't know none of that. And I'm here lying. I'm yo, 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 real shit, real shit. Yo, I was with Jay the other day, and we talking about basketball. He's like, "Yo, Dad, can you dunk?" I'm like, "Hell yeah, nigga!" I was, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 like shit. Yeah, that was me back in my day. I was fucking them up. Yeah, you know, three sixty windmill. Yeah, hell yeah, we gonna keep that. that, that that's the picture I want to paint until he can realize you lying like shit, bro. Yeah, like, at some point he gonna figure it out. You know what I'm saying? So, like, so that's man. what I'm saying. So Barry you figured this out at five? That's crazy. Yeah, that's bro. that's nuts. That's, yeah, nuts. Okay. that's yeah, nuts. like I'm and I'm not maybe that's why I'm a pessimist at heart with shit, but it might be. It might be. But, but bro, it might be. You but, that's why too early. That's why that's why he don't like Kanye album. Yeah. <laughs> but but what yeah. I will say, but what I will say, this is what say, you showed me. So this is what I'm gonna believe. I'm so, gonna believe. It. <laughs> oh, I think we got it. I think that's the answer. I guess, but oh, but, but 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 even with that, right? <clears throat> <laughs> but bes- even with that, I'm not mad that's at it. Answer. You know what I'm saying? It was. I didn't see it at the time. I saw it like that. I was like, damn. But then. What it did show me is that, yo, you can fuck up. You can do whatever is going on, even from then, yeah. and still fix the shit that you got going on. So that's why I said, yo, yeah, she lost the, she, she lost the Superwoman or Wonder Woman powers, but then I always say she gained it back because it was like a redeeming quality. It was like, damn, I fucked up. And then in her fucking up, it was like, yo, you know what? I'm going to fix it. And nobody going to fix it for me but me. And then when she fixed it, it's e- like, you know what? E- even that's too real. Not how kids, not how kids feel about their parents. That's too but, real. That's but the, that's what. But that's but the fact for me. That you that's had this why, moment. That's crazy. But that's I'm, what I'm saying. I'm not, so for me, I get, I'm not saying I gain, you're right or wrong. No, I know saying, that. You know, yeah. I gained. Okay. That's why I'm, I'm saying I gained the res- my mom has my utmost respect respect for that because I saw it and I saw her moment where she fucked up early and I was like, damn. No, that's then, crazy. That you saw that. Five, and then she fixed it, like, and it was that's like, really it. Honestly. That's all no, it is. Yeah, We're not like, okay, it's at, just like, man, that's just you know early how really it is? see it. I saw that at five, I, I, six. Five, six, I saw that, right? At I would say at eight, they broke into our crib and they stole all my Christmas toys at eight. So I had Brooklyn. Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Broke into our crib twice. <laughs> wow. I had no, you know what I'm saying? So my mom is like, yo, what the fuck? Like, I don't so even You got know. to see that. That's correct. You know what I'm saying? So now it's like, cool. And then she fixed it. So now... When she fixed the shit, it's like, oh shit! And she, when she fixed it, she fixed it. There was no issue now, and you she fixed it with no help. You know what's funny? People, people ask or they they wonder why there's so much trauma <laughs> in our communities. Mm-hmm. But just listen to the conversations we're having, bro. This nigga just—I just called you a nigga, but this mm. man just said. Toys on Christmas robbed. Mm-hmm. This is how we live. Mm-hmm. This is how we grow up. Mind you, that's he's why six. That's why I don't like Christmas. You remember when you always ask so, me, Barry, why you don't like Christmas? Bro, that's why I'm it's, right. just, it's just fucking crazy because now we look at somebody who's in the prison system and we say, oh, you're a bad apple. You're you're the oh, right, right. devil sure. demon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, we don't know what circumstances Sure. Or what happened in their life to drive them to be the person that they grew up to be? Bari, the situation, he just, Bari just said he saw his mom chink her armor at five 
by the age of 10, he had Christmas robbed from him twice. Mm-hmm. They were like, what? <laughs> this is Legit. a traumatic shit. Yo, I swear to God. Yeah. But, but this what is some really bad. shit, and, 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 and we, 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 we make bad, light bro. of it. I'm we make light bad, of it because we're here now and we're okay. But brother to brother, man to man, I can see these traumas in your everyday life now. Oh right. no, like Christmas, you already that, say, I don't like no, Christmas, no, no. you know that. No, no, no. But, but but can that's I say that's face me, value I, shit. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. I just wanna I just wanna say this. It's to the fact that right now you don't like gifts on your birthday or holidays. You're a grown ass man, fam. That shit happened when you was like ten. You damn near thirty. You know what I mean? You still like a gift. <gasps> It's just traumas that we go through. It's trauma, and, bro. You know what's funny? I, shout to my boy Wale for this, but mental health and psychiatrists, sociologists, whatever yeah. fucking word it is, these motherfuckers is real, and they should be prevalent in everyone's lives because if you need, we them, all go, we all go through some wild shit. That we need to be talked down and talked out of because of the, what we went through. The biggest thing I'm learning about what you go through is that not only do you go through it, but you build your life on it. Yeah. Like yeah. You, and that's the part that's been now that I've moved to Atlanta, I'm not in New York anymore. I don't pay that rent. I don't have any problems. I don't, but I'm still dragging the same thing. That brought me to New York. I'm still dragging that to me here in Atlanta. It's yeah. fucking me up. I was in New York for 10 years. And I'm still dragging this old ass shit. Yeah. You see it? You know, because you hear it. But what the fuck? At one point, when will I be, Bari, okay with a gift? At what point, you know what I'm saying? When do I forgive... My mom, you know what I'm saying? At what point do I... What the fuck, bro? That's trauma. And we drag this it's shit trauma. with all the all the women we date, all the friends we have, all the jobs we get. Yeah. It's all, crazy. All relationships, period. It doesn't go away. Yeah. I'm sure I hear That's you. real. I hear y'all. But listen, man. You know I what's guess. funny? For, for an unscripted show, this, is pretty, this has been a pretty damn good show. That's how dope we are. I mean, you know, that's what we do. Thank you for do, man. Willow Wednesdays. Wait, 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 Barry, before you go <laughs> there, I'm, I'm sorry, before you go there. I was going to end it too, though. I had you, Barry, I had you back. I was going to end it too. I'm, what, I'm, what I'm, I'm, I'm with the end, but I've watched enough. You know what's funny? I've watched enough shows and listened to enough, whatever, Listen to enough. Whatever, people. whatever, yeah, yeah, okay, go ahead. Let's come to a culmination because we all oftentimes we just leave with everything we lay on the table and we slide about it. Like, well, yep. Yeah. <laughs> hey, okay. How can we culminate this? How can we, in conclusion, how can we give that positive note to know. leave the people with? I don't know. Because people have been watching us for the last hour and a half talk about shit. How can we culminate it? Get and I know I'm, I know I'm asking this on the fly. And hey, this is this is a real moment, y'all. We having a real ass moment. We this is very unscripted. But how can we culminate this? Oh, no. All I'm all I'm gonna say is commun- communication is key. And the one thing that that I've learned from from us doing this podcast for the last five six years is that being that we talk shit out, this has been our therapy. So, mm. and I know that for you, Barry, I know that for you, Jay, mm-hmm. we have literally created our own therapy. So it's a oh, you the show. Oh, you mean with the show? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's real. No, okay. that's real. So, so I know, cool. I know for a fact that um, communication is key. Like as long as we're, oh, and we have to be able and open. And this show has taught me that. And yo, ho- hopefully y'all learn from that. So, so if we can come in at this whole conversation, uh, people, that, that good, people, you got to communicate and be happy. I'm not happy, but you got to, you got to be ready to communicate. 
and be open enough to have the conversations. Cause that's something that we've had as friends. And I think that we've, we've had closer moments as real people mm-hmm. because we've done that. Like, you know, I, and tonight was a real moment. Like I actually was really listening by it. Just, you know, I talk a lot of shit. I drink, I'm always ready to make the joke. You know me, nigga. I'm like, ah, but I don't even think that none of that is crazy to be honest with you. I, like, I, I mean, that's I what I do. No, I'm talking. But, no, I'm talking about y'all yeah, hearing that. I don't even think that's that crazy. Nah, but you know, the typical you mean that you live through it and you put a guard up, but somebody hearing that story that could be that could be everything for them. I get you right. You right. You right. So you can't say that because you you meet that five six year old that's now thirty five, and they've never had a, a place where they could speak to it or you know. Yeah. That's real. And that's crazy because I, I ain't never heard five or six. That age is wild to me. But I remember being five and six. It was only cartoons, that, you know, first grade. And that's it. Was all of that. It was Dame all of that so for me old, too. But. Dame so old that his cartoons was hand puppets in front of the TV. They were just they were just here. <laughs> it wasn't, it was, it was not, Listen, man, thank you for watching Willow Wednesdays once again. Thank y'all for watching, man. I follow like this. and subscribe. Bring somebody to church. Give us a hey he's really, Wednesdays. He's really laughing at this hand puppet thing. Comment. Nah, you old as shit, nigga. Comment your how old you think joke. Dame is. Your hand puppet joke Listen. wasn't even funny. <laughs> comment how old you think Dame he's is. He's going off uh, right now. <laughs> said, come tell us what you think about getting your booty ate. <laughs> Uh, all that shit. How old you think Dame is? And we out. <laughs> Cut the shit. We out, bro. Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning into Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the facts, support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.